Was he a big part of the gang? Who, Jonas? I don't know, yeah. Let me guess. He spent his time oozing round the girls, offering back rubs. Not really. Circling for an orifice. Was he always that oily? OK, look. What? It's nothing, but you might have noticed a bit of an atmosphere because me and Jonas, years ago, had a bit of a thing. You had a thing with Oily Dude Man? It was just a little thing. I didn't even know you back then. So <laughs> you slept with Oily Dude Man. That's hilarious. <laughs> We've all got our skeletons. What about you and Gemma? Well, I told you about Gemma. Gemma was a nutcase. <laughs> But you never told me about Jonas. I did. I told you I hooked up with someone in Marrakesh. Jonas is Mr. Marrakesh? For a month. It was a stupid thing. I thought Mr. Marrakesh was supposed to be some super cool. Not him. It was years ago and... Are you embarrassed by that? It was years ago. But you dated him. For a month. That's what I said. Because when you told me about Mr. Marrakesh, it was a week. No, I didn't. <laughs> but the point is, it wasn't a big deal. Well, it was a big enough deal to do your head in. Oh, you're getting obsessed. I'm not. We had all this with Dan. I don't want you going like that again. He had little creepy beady eyes. And he was always... Oh, what? Acting like he was interested. And you know what? I think he probably did fancy me. And actually, he wasn't completely hideous, so in another life, I don't know, but nothing happened. And Jonas, he's an old fling. So what? Don't go all fucked up. What? Well, I'm fucked up, am I? No, I mean, just... No, 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 that's brilliant. Sometimes you're a bitch. I didn't mean that. 